Hi, welcome to How to D&D. My name is Fred Wheeler and today I want to talk about how to make a greatsword melee attack. This video is brought to you by D&D Wow's Color Changing Dice. For this demonstration I'll be using the pre-made character sheet from the Dungeons & Dragons 5e starter set. This is the Fighter Folk Hero. Our greatsword does the following. A plus 4 for your attack bonus and 2d6 plus 2 for damage. When you want to make an attack with your greatsword, make sure to move your character right up close so you're within 5 feet of the creature you want to attack. In this case we have a gelatinous cube. Select a 20 sided dice and roll the 20 sided dice to make your attack roll. I rolled a 5 in this case, I'm going to be adding 5 to the attack modifier which is 4. So 5 plus 4 is 9. Compare your attack result to the armor class of the gelatinous cube. The gelatinous cube has an armor class of 6, so your attack is a 9, that is greater than or equal to the attack, which means you actually hit with your greatsword. When you hit with your greatsword, you're going to be rolling damage next. Roll 2d6 plus your strength modifier for this damage. I've rolled a 4, I've rolled a 5, so 4 plus 5 is 9, plus the strength modifier for my fighter here, that is 2, so that is a total of 11. Your greatsword attack does 11 slashing damage. There are two things you need to consider when using a greatsword. A greatsword is a heavy weapon, which means if you are a small creature, you have disadvantage when making an attack roll. A greatsword is also a two-handed weapon, which means you need both hands to swing the weapon to make your attack. I hope you found this video useful. If you would like to know more about D&D WoW's color changing dice or support this channel, check down in the description. And hey, till next time, keep rolling those 20s.